Clearly, my minions are off their riddling and need a shot at Demerol. This is some random gameplay of Diablo on my Necromancer. And that's pretty much it. There's nothing overly exciting going on. Just want to showcase a little bit of gameplay from a different perspective. And that is pretty much it. I want to try to get caught up as uh, fast as possible with my paladin. Then I want to get my druid going as well, even though they're not technically, you know, the meta for like soloing hell and all that kind of stuff. I honestly don't really care. Uh, for me, it's just about having fun. And I had fun with uh, with the druid in the beta. I really, really did. I enjoy having all of them doing all my work for me. Large axe. Well, we got a few things to identify. That helps us with getting more money for our shit. Can be inserted into a side item required for damage. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, let's just keep going. I can't carry anymore. Yeah, so now we have our follower, four skeletons, which I believe is the max we can have, and one golem. Which is really, really nice. It's like half a dozen frickin' people. I gotta be able to turn off that. I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. I'm gonna stick my foot in your ass. Foot in your ass. NPC speech. It's the error that I want. NPC controls the voice, visual text. Hmm. Yeah, it's the error that I want to turn off. Doesn't appear like I can do it. Whatever. Yeah, I'm really enjoying the Necro. I am the only thing I don't like, which I'm allowed to complain about because I've been spoiled with Diablo 3, is just how much harder it is to manage your mana. Like, I mean, I always run out of mana. Like, I'm constantly out of mana. And I don't really seem to have that many ranged abilities as the Necro. I mean, I have this, as you can see, but it just... It sucks me dry. Maybe later on it gets a little bit better with mana regen. I really don't know how that works. Oh, we gotta pick up the small shield. It's gold! No one cares about that. Might as well use it. Small shield. Hmm. Could be... Could be decent. Well, look at you. That could be good for my... My paladin. We're gonna use a scroll to go back to town soon. Right now, I'm just literally trying to plow through this underground passage. I wish I could spam that 24-7, but clearly that would be OP. I don't remember doing this 
on my paladin, and it's taken me this long to find... to, you know... Oh, there, to the dark wood. Underground passage level 2, but that makes me believe there's a passage level... or a passage level 2. But now we're in the dark wood. And this is important. Oh, wow. I'll explain in a second. A lot of stuff going on there. Because our quest log. So this one here, we got to go through the underground passage to the dark wood and then search for the tree of Inifis to get the scroll. And then here we got to look for the tower in the Black Marsh, which is beyond the dark wood. Needless to say, the first thing. Oh, it's right here. This tree shines with inner Seriously? Well, you're gonna have to figure it the F out. I can't carry anymore. Oh my god. There we go. That's a big ass scroll. I'll worry about that after, I suppose. Yeah, I'll worry about that after. Right now. I got a few things laying on the ground. I think this is the most important thing to do. Yeah, let's go back to Akara. I got enough scrolls anyways, so... I don't need to be shy about using them. Yeah, it is very good. Get rid of this. That's good. I don't want to get rid of that. Hmm. Definitely going to put this away. Yeah, now we've got to go back. Go back to the stone fields. That's pretty simple. So we don't even need to take our portal back, actually. What we do is... Uh, I'll show you in a moment. So we can leave that portal that you could see there, the yellow dot. We'll go to Stony Field, I think it is. Is it Stony Field? Touch the stones, yes, the stones are just up here. Then we're gonna go and find. You don't even need to know the order. Just click them. It's not really a puzzle. Well, I mean, it is, but it isn't. There we go. Now, a portal's gonna open up. All that's left of proud Tristram are ghosts and ashes. Help! You know, when I first saw him, I'm not gonna lie. Wow, eh? Look at that ass whooping. Wow. First time I did this on my paladin, I was like, he's yelling. I'm like, where is he? I kept running around like this. I was like, where is he? He's right here. Yeah, bumbling fool. 
If you value your life, leave here immediately. Wait, what? Bad wristwold. How many people are here? Oh, look at that goblin. Ouch. I can't carry anymore. Well, piss on you. Yeah, so this will bring us back to Stony Field. Because now we need to go back to the uh, encampment, but I don't want to use my portal. Because I still have that one open to go to that new place that I just discovered. You have risked your life to no, rescue looks like my portal's gone. For that we thank you. We must seek his counsel in need. Ah, oh, seriously? Well, it worked the last time. Oh no, it's right there. Okay. Yeah. Because I haven't grabbed it yet. A token of my regret. Stay a while and listen. Yeah, he identifies items for free now, which is pretty badass. Mercenary. I'll put that nice. The there you go. 10% faster cast rate. Hmm. I got so many rings, but whatever. I'm having fun. It's amazing how different when I fled the monastery, Diablo 3 is to 2. Like, it just blows me away. I was so afraid it was going to be like, well, this is just like Diablo 3, but it's older. Yeah, no. Completely, completely different vibe. It's, it's like, you almost can't compare them in a way, even though they're virtually identical in the sense that they're both Diablo games, right? They're almost as different as Call of Duty is to Battlefield. There's a big bold statement I made, and I'm sticking to it. Yeah, so now we're done that. Yeah, look for the Horodric Malice and the Monastery Barracks. But we still need to do the Forgotten Tower. Uh, we're coming along nicely. We really are. So this is where we just came from. The underground passage. Now what I'm going to do is quite simply uncover some of the map. Look for the waypoint. Fast travel waypoint. I like how my people, my minions, are pretty much doing everything for me. I just go around looting shit. Found it. Nope. That's the well. I think once I hit level 10, I'm going to end the video. Yeah, see the Black Marsh. Well, there is a fast travel point in the Black Marsh. 
but we don't even have one where we are here. But oftentimes, the waypoints are very close. To the entrance. So I'm just gonna scout it out really quick. And we are level 10. Yeah, I don't know where it is. I mean, I could keep looking, but I definitely don't want to get too ahead of myself. Did I just zap him? That was interesting. I know I could poison them. I think I have that spell on my Necro in Diablo 3. It looks familiar. I think it's called something else, or it actually might even look like the... Uh that voodoo guy, I forget the hell he's called. The class there. He's got something that looks visually like that skill. Whether or not it does the same thing. Yeah, so I'm just going to explore the dark wood really quick. Not much else to show off, really. But we are on the right track. Look for the tower in the Black Marsh. In the Black Marsh. We're in the dark wood. Black Marsh. I don't know where this one is. Look for the Horatric Malice in the Monastery Barracks. All I know is this is the next zone. So I'm going to fully explore it before I go anywhere else. Yeah, I have a feeling I'm going to be enjoying this, the Paladin, and the Druid quite a bit. The Druid I'm worried about because the best spec for the Druid is actually not the spec I want to be. It's all about, like, the wind and stuff like that. I, I want to be, like, the animal form that just looks to be the most fun to me. But because it's my third character, you know... Like the Paladin and the Necro are considered like S ranked. Really? I didn't have. Th oh, that is what I was looking for. Okay. Nice. But haven't I been here before? Oh my god, it was near me the whole time. That's hilarious. Wow, that's funny. It was just there the whole time right next to the entrance. Well, that I might as well use up in a minute to go and empty my bags. And I do wish the running was infinite. Not gonna lie. So much shit going on on the screen. It's so different than the Paladin. Whoa. 
What I am confused about... Is I don't know... If there's anything in the dark wood that I needed to do. I keep forgetting. I just don't know where this is. I have a feeling it's in the dark woods. There's still some areas that I haven't explored yet. You can see it all here. I can't carry anymore. But this I like because now I know where the fast travel waypoint is. Yeah, I think it's time for me to go to the other zone. I need mana. But I mean just grinding is is not bad. Cuz my paladin is around this Place, like in terms of progression but he's like level 12 and I'm almost 11 so yeah it's not really far behind I think that's the right word but I kind of like doing what I'm doing here with the map. And because it's single player, and I've mentioned this before, and I haven't switched difficulties, the map doesn't change, but when you're playing online, it changes all the time. It's never the same map twice. Yeah, I just don't think there's anything in here. Unless there's something going on in here that I haven't noticed or paid attention to. No, I think that's it. I am overburdened. Hmm. I am overburdened. You are now, eh? Well, maybe I will go quickly look for the waypoint in the Black Marsh. Yeah, look for the tower in the Black Marsh. I still have to find where to get that quest. I forgot where I got this quest from to begin with on my paladin, because I don't even think he has it. Hmm. There's that electricity again. Yeah, so that other zone I was just in, it doesn't look like there's really anything there. I'm trying to rush as fast as possible. Not something that really goes hand in hand with this game. But I'm saying it anyways. My paladin can kill those in just a few hits. It's actually pretty wild. I could have ended this video eons ago, but whatever. I'm having fun. I hate the walking. I really wish we could just always run and have bigger inventory. I know, I know. 
and the mana. That's probably my three biggest things. Mana, inventory, and the speed of the character. But it makes it more hardcore. Truthfully, it just it's tedious, but I can't carry anymore. It is what it is. It won't stop me from having fun. See to the hole. And again, my quest says look for in the monastery barracks. Look for the tower in the black marsh. Well, Clearly, if I go in that cave, that's the wrong spot. Entering the Tamo Highland. Do we have a fast travel point right here? Because that's definitely not an area I want to start playing around in. Because now I'm just... Oh, wow. What was that? Holy shit, eh? I need mana. Wow, they're dropping some nice gold. Yeah, no. We're not ready for that. Let's find that tower. Oh. Uh oh. We found the Black Marsh waypoint. And I think that's going to be my cue. Yeah, I'm going to empty my shit and then I'm just going to keep playing on my own. Again. Just wanted to showcase a little bit of gameplay of the Necro. Give you an idea of what it looks like. That's pretty much it. So as always, if you liked the video, go ahead, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, go ahead, give it a thumbs down. You notice how they've got three arrows stuck in their shield? My skeletons there? And how they're twitching around like that? Well, that's what you're going to be doing for the rest of your life. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, I mean, naturally, that would be fantastic. But if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care, and maybe I shall see some of you in the next video. Bye for now.